win and no losses. Fighting out of four boys top team, Bakersfield, California. Sam Rival. His opponent stands across the cage in the red corner with a record of one win and two losses. Fighting out of Team Concrete, Livermore, California. Concrete, Cameron Olsen. The referee in charge of the action inside the cage is Ryan Tackett. Once again, our format is three two-minute rounds. Sid Rival is wearing the red and the white trunks. Concrete Cameron Olsen is wearing the black trunks. Both fighters in the 135-pound bantamweight division. We are live in Las Vegas on Go Fight Live. Jason Mahoney alongside Dave Farah. It is great to be here with you tonight. Again, three two-minute rounds. Final instructions now from the referee. They are going to touch him up, head back to their corners, and we are set to go with our second fight of the night. Best promo shots ever right there. Whoa! The white. Concrete Cameron Olsen coming out swinging. He is ready to brawl. And he accidentally slips, goes to the ground. Cameron Olsen again in the black trunks. This is the pace of the fight that I expected when I Big saw these knee. two are going to be fighting each other. He's got to be careful. Can't throw knees to the head in amateur mixed martial arts. Even standing, yes. Big right there Huge by lights. Concrete. Concrete Cameron Olsen lands a couple of shots. Sid Rival goes to the ground. Concrete Cameron Olsen in top position right now, but it looks like Sid Rival has recovered. I mean, we're a minute into this fight, Dave, not even, and we've already seen, you know, two swings in both directions. Both these fighters, very entertaining. Look at this, though. Concrete Cameron Olsen has the back. Is he able to get that arm underneath that chin? It looks like he He's may have it. it. He's still working, trying to complete that, but he is flattening him out right now. This could be a really bad spot for Sid Rival. Concrete Cameron Olsen. Referee watching it closely. Does not appear oh. to be quite enough just yet. Yeah. He Sid Rival's doing a nice job of tying up those hands. The hand fighting is what this is all about in these very precious moments. If he can get that arm beneath that chin looks it looks like he's almost got it right now if he's able to secure that right hand that is being held by Sid Rival right now Sid Rival could potentially go to sleep and there oh. it is this is a really bad spot now for Sid Rival. But Rival does a good job of pulling that arm off that two there on you go. one that's how you defend that rear naked choke concrete Cameron Olsen is he still. postures up into full mount and all of a sudden Sid Rival goes ahead and reverses it now he's in top position final 10 seconds of round number one and Sid Rival is now turning on the offense. Landed some decent shots there at the end. That's the end of round number one. Exactly as we thought it would be. Wildly entertaining. I'm glad that this fight's continuing on to a round Me number too, two. I think, the, I think the fans here at the Cannery deserve another round from these two, two, two amazing fighters. Yeah, I mean, Concrete Cameron Olsen promised he was going to come out and be a really exciting fighter tonight, and guess what? He did just that. But Sid Rival is game. That's what I love about Sid Rival is that you can punch him in the face, and a lot of fighters would give up in that spot where the fighter has the arm fully beneath the chin and they're able to actually secure that hand onto the bicep because if you think that you're just done in that position, not Sid Rival. He reversed out of it, ended up in top position at the end of round number one, throwing punches of his own. And being able to reach behind your head like that and pull his arm off while simultaneously being choked. A lot of tricep strike there, man. A lot of tricep strike. Absolutely. You can tell he spent some time doing dips in the gym, The one muscle I'm proud of, my triceps. <laughs> you do have nice triceps. Yeah, thank you, yeah. thank you. Everything yeah, else just flat. A to horrible. total hot mess, yes. but your triceps, unbelievable. Round number two, Concrete Cameron Olsen, you see on your screen right now, he is wearing the black trunks. Sid Rival is wearing the red and the white trunks. There he is, set to go with two more minutes on the clock. And I'll tell you what, man, those first two minutes seem like an eternity. These guys put a lot of action in those first two minutes. I expect the same thing here. And again, they come out throwing leather, throwing big punches. Haymakers, both of them, they landed too. That one looked a little low, but I can't tell if that concrete, concrete Cameron Olsen on the boys or not, but he's fighting on, not making any complaints right now. Yeah, it was kind of a teeth kick that Cameron Olsen caught and then it sort of snuck down from there, but you're right. Cameron Olsen doing a nice job fighting through, and these two just in a slugfest right now. 
I don't want to see this fight go to the ground, Dave. I want to see these guys, these guys just bang it out because it's just wildly entertaining. Sid Rival has different plans. Oh. He goes to the ground, but he ends up in bottom position and just about as unfortunate of a spot as he could end up in. Not only did Concrete Cameron Olsen end up in full mount, he also had his arm around his neck. And you see Concrete Cameron Olsen is lighting him up right now, trying to soften him up so he can once again get that back. He's looking for that submission, but he is softening him up first with a bunch of punches. Now, is he able to do it in just 60 seconds time because that's all he has left? It's one oh. of the great challenges of fighting an amateur mixed martial arts. He does have that arm beneath that chin, but again, hand fighting comes into play. Oh, this could be it. I think that's going to be it. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Concrete Cameron Olsen gets the finish here at Tough Enough. And I think the just the uh, the endurance there from Sid Rival, I think, I think you know, that first round took a lot out of him after defending that rear naked choke for as long as he did. The, 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 the kind of catalyst right there that led to Concrete Cameron Olsen taking top mount in just, just a dominant position where they ran into the cage reminded me something almost out of like WWE when you throw your opponent into the ropes and then it immediately gets reversed. And then they end up on top of you. Yes. Yeah, it, just it's very, almost as if it was scripted very, very in the favor of Concrete Cameron Olsen. It was actually Sid Rival that was going for the takedown. He pushed Cameron Olsen into the fence, was driving him through. They bounce off the fence and next thing you know, Concrete Cameron Olsen ends up in top position, gets the finish and Mahoney, you had a great point just a couple of seconds ago when you said that you know, it's entirely possible that Sid Rival was a bit winded from the first round. Most people, when they're watching a fight, they have respect for the person that's delivering the offense, the one that's throwing the punches or searching for the submissions. But you have to have an appreciation for how much exertion it takes to defend that as well. And that seemed to get the better of Sid Rival in this spot. And once again, credit to Concrete Cameron Olsen for finishing this fight in the second round. Just an insane pace that these two gentlemen set. And you know what? Wildly entertaining. Congrats to both of them. Hope to see them again here at the Tough Enough Fighting Championships because both of these guys always come to fight. Excellent fight tonight here at the Cannery. Again, thanks for joining us on GoFightLive.tv. It is great to have you with us. Here comes the official announcement from the judges. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute, 13 seconds into the second round, your winner by tap out to your rear naked choke, Concrete Cameron Olsen. We have 12 more fights on the schedule tonight. I can watch 12 more Sid Rival and Concrete Cameron Olsen fights. <laughs>